My name is Charles. I like to drive buses. I like to go to church. And my favorite color is yellow. And I have autism. I'm gonna give you guys a piece of paper, all right? Paper. And you guys. I'm Deidre, and I am a teacher here, a special education teacher, and I've been teaching for 15 years. Um, I started actually in home programming, uh, so I, I count that as five years. And then uh, I was at another school before here, and I've been teaching in the classroom for 10 years with uh, really kids all over the spectrum. Currently the kids are high functioning kids with autism, but I've taught kids from, you know, the what they would consider to be the lowest functioning kids all the way up. The clown doing the tango or No, the just goose? just a turkey burger, thanks. Okay, so no lettuce. Just turkey. This burger. is the greatest group of kids that ever existed. Um, these kids are um, really truly gifted and really very very special. Let's have one more waitress. The best part about them is that they're just like everybody else. They're just misunderstood. My name is Desi. I am 13 years old. I have a brother. And um, my favorite singing group is Destiny's Child. My favorite type of music is R&B and jazz. And my favorite color is blue. My favorite bugs are butterflies. And I have autism. Is autism who you are, or is it just part of you? Dante? It's just part of you. It's just part of you, right? It's mm -hmm. not, it's not, you're not Don, Dante, that autistic kid, right? You're Dante, that kid who has autism, right? right? Yeah. But that's just one part of you, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Because there's so many important things about you, right? Yeah. right. That have nothing to do with autism. Yeah. Like, when I see Dante, I look at Dante and I think, there's Dante, that funny kid. He's so funny, and he's so caring, and he's so genuine, and he's such a good singer, and he has such a great attitude about life, and I wish that I could wake up every morning and be more like Dante because he's always happy and smiling and in a good mood. And sure, Dante has autism, but that's not the most important part about Dante, is it? Nope. It affects you the way your brain is working and the way that you're learning, right? right. And it might affect the way that you're making friends. Right. I teach yeah, them that, that having autism yeah. is completely okay yeah. and that it is a part of them, but it is not who they are. If someone, you know, demands on calling them, there's that autistic girl that they should definitely correct them and say that no, I'm my name is such and such and I have autism, but it's just a part of who I am as opposed to you know being everything that they are they they have learned that having autism is is their reality but it doesn't have to be a, a sentence um, and I think as a result they've learned ways to sort of get around it and strategies to overcome it autism is invisible and and you can't see autism I went to Six Flags because there are lots of places like um, Marvin the Martian. They have lots of characters out there. I went there. You went there? Yep. Yep. I went there a while ago. Wow. Hi, my name is Zach. Uh, um, my favorite singing group is the uh, is the Junior Chapel, led by Mike O'Donnell. They sing the Thomas songs. Uh, I like going to sleep by the sound of trains. It's kind of like music to me. I'm, I, I'm social here, but it's just that I'm, I don't feel, I don't have any neighborhood friends, so that I'm not really social in my neighborhood. But other than that, I'm just fine. I'm just a kid with autism. I'm Kelsey. I'm 12 years old. I, 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 I. I, I, I like to listen to music. I like to play video games. I like to go to, to the playground. 
and and I like to watch some videos like sing along songs and and I have autism. No, no, wait, 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 wait. I I have a brother and a mom. I have autism. My name is Alex. I'm 14 years old. My favorite singing group is the uh, the Black Eyed Peas. I I probably like the Village People. My village favorite, The Village People. My favorite color is green. I I. I like game shows. I like sports. I have one brother, one sister, and one mother. And I have autism. I have no idea what makes me autistic. All I know is that I was diagnosed with autism when I was six. It was seven years ago, actually. I wasn't even sure if people would like me anymore. I hear people uh, say all the time that children with autism are are not related or are not able to connect or are not able to really um, have meaningful relationships with people and um, wow that is that's just so false. I used to have a friend in room one Pierce he is right next door right next door room 17. I usually see him sometimes and uh, well he's kind of like one of he's kind of like my best friend he like he and I like trains. We have something in common. We're friends because we like to do the Little Mermaid and Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas and 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 the Berenstain Bears. Oh, the Berenstain Bears and 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 we do Pokemon. Poke and Pokemon. I really have never met a, a person with autism that can't connect on some level. Um, it might be difficult in some ways. They're always connecting. It might just be a different way of connecting. It might not be the way that we're used to seeing them, or seeing other people connect, but they connect. When you went to Ocean City? On my vacation. On your vacation. I see them as being so close to being able to be part of what is considered you know, the typical world, but they're always standing just outside looking in. I don't think that they're understood. I think especially when there's some hand movement going on or some jumping up and down with excitement or when they're not able to sort of regulate their sensory systems, then it makes it difficult for people to understand what's going on or what they're seeing. And rather than ask questions or, um, or just you know, keep to themselves, you'll see pointing or laughing and that sort of thing. And so it is difficult for them because they don't understand why people are laughing or they don't understand why people um, look at them funny because to them, they're just who they are. So it, it wouldn't make sense to them. And it would never occur to them to do that to someone else. So it, it, it doesn't, doesn't make any sense to them. It makes it difficult. I, that's why it's important to not just teach our kids, but to also teach the world that our kids are okay. My name is Dante. I am 13 years old. I I like I like I like to go to the playground, swing on swings, watch game shows. Um, um, uh, I like, I have one sister and one mom and one mom and one mommy. And I have autism. That's how it works. Javon, Javon.